What's up, YouTube? Man, oh yeah. Okay, so today I just want to show you a nice little pattern that you can use. It's a nice little diminished pattern that you can use anytime you go to a major chord. Or anytime you go to your one, five, two major, whatever. When you use a, a major chord, you can use this. Okay, so. So let's assume that you know that you use a whole, half, whole, half, whole, half, whole, half tone scale for diminished chords. Okay, so now what do you do? You know the scale and you know the chords. But the thing is, how do you put it together? First question, what diminished chord do you use? So if I want to go, this is a shortcut I use. If I want to go to C, all I need to do is make sure that the diminished chord that I use has a D in it. Okay, so basically a whole step up. So which means that works, okay, because it has a D in it. That works because it has a D in it. That works because it has a D in it. That works because it, it has a D in it. Okay. So whatever major chord you want to go to, if you want to go to F sharp, then your diminished chord needs to have a G sharp in it. And then you can go to that major. Okay, so that's the first step. Just identify which diminished chord you can use. Okay, so now what you do is, it's a very visual thing. Okay, so, I've, so what you do is, you have four notes. So what you're going to do, let's, we're going to number all of the notes. We're going to number one, two, three, four. Okay, and what you're gonna do is, from number two, you're gonna play a whole half diminished scale all the way to the four. And then once you get to the four, you're gonna go come back to the three, which is basically inversion, okay? So you're basically coming. Okay, you're coming from that four to the three. Okay, so that's the idea. So let's say we go to the F, for example. Let's say we wanna go to the F. First thing, I will step up. Okay, so we start in the G. We need to use a diminished chord that has a G in it. Okay, there we go. Now what we do is, from the two, we play a whole half scale. So that's B flat, C. Okay, so it's a whole half. It's okay, the whole half, whole half. And then we land on the four. But once we land on the four, we come back to the three. And that's the pattern. So there you go. And then once you're here, then you can play the F chord. And that's the pattern, guys. And now all you do is you start adding chords. So instead of just playing the melody, we're going to substitute that for actual diminished chords. So what you're going to do is you're going to substitute all these for diminished chords that has these notes as the highest notes. Okay. So first one. Okay, so that's the diminished chord. Now what we're going to do is we're going to play drop twos of those diminished chords. So basically we're going to take out the second highest note and play it on left hand. And then play the same pattern. Okay guys, so that's the idea. Remember, anytime you want to go to a major chord, hold step up from where you want to go. Make sure your diminished chord has that note in. And then you play the pattern. Okay, so I just want to show you an example of how it sounds real quickly. And then I'll see you again real soon. Thank you, guys. If you want to see more of this kind of stuff, click the link below. And I'll see you again real soon. Thank you. God bless. Bye-bye. <laughs>